eh, para que se adelanta. So, if we have a constitution that is truly and truly believe in what it says, we should really observe every letter, every article and provision of that constitution. Everyone should know the bounds and limits of their duties, responsibilities, powers, and authorities to ensure propriety and observance of protocols and orders. All transactions and records should be made ready for scrutiny and copy procurement by any interested members. Topping all this is the need for us to have a permanent office for our national headquarters. Matagal na po ang Alpha Sigma Phi, kasama ako noong 1980, Alpha Sigma Phi sa Matulog, uh, kailangan natin ng opisina. Brother Ray D. Reyes, I think, I, if I remember right, masyadong pogi pa nung si Brother Ray D. Reyes, batang-bata. Kasama po yan. Oh, kailangan natin, 50 years daw, kailangan nasa Dumaguete, ang national headquarters. Nandiyan si Sis May, uh, May Joy, ba? Nandiyan si Brad uh, Abraham Lumantas. Uh, Nandiyan sila noon sa, sa Siliman. That's when this thing uh, was crafted. 50 years. Eh, sabi ko kay, <laughs> kay Brad uh, Rick Martinez, Brad, masyado naman nga tang matagal yan. Patay na tayo o doon nandiyan pa yung headquarters niya. Hindi ba pwedeng galing sa Cebu? Hindi pwedeng galing sa Manila? Hindi ka. Dito lang yan. Sa Dumaguete. <laughs> yes. Now, we have this dilemma. We are now declared illegal. Do we have the right to go uh, to, his, uh, to his house? The national headquarters is not an office. It is his house. Can you just barge in? <laughs> Ipapakulong po tayo ni Brother Rick Martinez. Mawawala ni Brother Lila. Ipapakulong si Brother Ray Di Reyes. Ipapakulong yan si Brother Alex Paulino. Wala na, hindi yan kilala. And, and so, we really have to have our own office. Ito po ay pagmumulan ng stability. Pag may office ka tayo, we can do business with other organizations. Pwede na, tayo, pwede na tayo magkaroon ng sariling telepono. Sabi nga ni Brad Lemuel Malano, Brad Ray D. Reyes, may telephone, may telephone ba yung Alpha Sigma Phi? Telephone number direct and contact, Alpha Sigma Phi? Wala po. Pagkatawag ka sa Alpha Sigma Phi, telepono ni Brad Rick Martinez. Ang gagamit ito. Hindi po pwede yan. We cannot live with this kind of environment forever. And so, as an organization, we should move forward and we should be proactive and try to dream for our own building. So, project po natin yan. It is so stated in our constitution, 1980 constitution, that there should be this type of building for Alpha Sigma. We will try, we will try to initiate. I know two years is so short a time. It is only but a dream. But we will start that dream. We enjoin the registering of chapters and alumni associations for proper recording and monitoring by the National Council through the NEDO. Eh, hindi na nga po tayo makapasok doon kay Brad Rick Martinez. So, kailangan na po natin for management purposes kailangan po natin na listahan ng mga problem chapters. We have a form there uh, which is ready for you to fill up. Um, pwede po kuha kayo dyan kung may chapter kayo or if you are representing an association, you have a form right there. And from that, that will be, that will be the initial listing of our chapters and associations. Meron din po tayong red book, membership yan, nandiyan, membership book. That is truly the registered members of Alta Sigma Hindi po yung listahan yung nakalista kay Brad Rick Martinez. 
di ba al pasig mabay is an an incorporated organization it is listed and recognized by the security service state commission so kailangan ng pangalan na kung pagmiembro tayo kasama po tayo ng mga estado ay pagbumuta po tayo sa mga atrawan ng tasko doktor ako pwede ko makita kung member ako yan ay sorry wala po kayo members members pero kayo ng incorporators pero members wala good for me ay kasama po ako doon so this red book this membership book it please all the delegates you should um you should uh, be listed there and i also enjoy all palawan um alpha cities should sign there kasi dadalhin po natin yan <coughs> that will be included among the documents that we are going to submit to the securities and exchange commission as soon as we are ready with other documents ito po ang mga dokumento na magpapatunay na tayo ang legal. We have this uh, edge over the others, over the other group, because uh, Brad Boyer Magallanes is actually the uh, recognized president of Alpha Sigma Phi. Kahit ano po yung gagawin nila, hindi po masasakawan yan. And that is our advantage. We will continue those documents. We will provide them whatever is needed or whatever are needed para lang uh, ma-hold on natin yung legit or legit na siya. <clears throat> Relevant policies shall be crafted by this administration to supplement the general provisions of the Constitution. Marami po nun kasi yung general uh, our Constitution bodies or any Constitution is actually general in nature. Parang anilang buyan guide. We need policies to be crafted in order that these provisions shall be understood properly by our members. Para po malinawan, itali natin po, uh, itali po natin yan. And this is a challenge to the new POT. We will be crafting the policies of Alpha Sigma Phi Philippines International Political Service Organization in Corporate. We will come out with our national policy. Finally, it is my wish that in due time, our fraternity shall be one whole again. Of course, when I say that, I mean, you know, joining hands again with the rebels. This we can hope by the strength of the true values and principles of the mystic circle, the spirit of brotherly love of Alpha Sigma Phi. Brothers and sisters in Alpha Sigma Phi, thank you very much for this opportunity that you have accorded my person. It is a great honor to be um, the president of Alpha Sigma Phi for 2016 2018. Marami, marami, marami salamat po. And before I go, I just would like to acknowledge, men, hindi po ako bago sa Palawan. Hindi po ako stranger sa Palawan. May, may mga nakakakilala po sa akin dito. Uh, although I'm from Tawi Tawi, pero yung Nagagalang Herod Castillo na saan ka? Yan, si Cecilia Montero, si Brad Joseph Sombroso, si Brad Hanley Tamar, kasama yan, si Malin Villesa Gisto, and si Stan Formoso. Sila po ay mga student leaders na pumunta ng Bagyo, 1992-93. I was also an advisor. I was the Dean of Student Affairs at the Mindanao State University at the time. Uh, we met, unang-una po, si Brad Herald Castillo. Nag-lulokin po yan. Hey, Brad! Brad! Alpan sa po, Tagapalawan. Maraming po kami dito. Yan si Herald. So, I'm so happy to meet these people. They are now 
uh, one of the best members of our city. Thank you. Thank you very much, National President. Brothers and sisters, once again, a round of applause to our National President. Thank you, Brother Nasir, for sharing with us your vision for Alpha Sigma P for 2016-2018. At this point of